Hello and welcome everyone, Anf Wolf here bringing you a Let's Talk video for September 2015. If you're unfamiliar with my Let's Talk videos, I normally try to release them once per month and basically I just want to talk to you all about what's been happening on and here on my channel for the past month and what I will be doing in the future as the months go on here on YouTube. If you have any interest in that, feel free to stick around, and if not, that's fair enough. Uh, feel free to return to whatever you were doing uh, this Friday the 11th of September when I release this video. Disclaimer, of course, I'm recording it the day before. Uh, but yeah, I have a few things to obviously talk about, and a few, a few game titles that are coming out in the future that I will hopefully be recording content for. The most uh, outstanding thing I want to mention is a massive thank you. I It may not seem it when I speak because I have one of those kind of voices and I mentioned it a couple of times. But no, I want to thank you all a great deal. Uh, as of yesterday, at the time of I'm recording this on Thursday the 10th of September, I went into the triple digits of subscribers here. Um, I just gained my 100th subscriber, thank you very much. Um, I should have mentioned your name and I should have done a bit of research and I apologise because I didn't. Um, in fact, two seconds. I should do this. Mr. Zuhahaha. <laughs> there you go. You are, my, you are my 100th subscriber. Thank you very much. Had a quick look there on my... Um, while I'm just sitting here watching our melody played out in the background, which I recorded previously to talking about this basically but no i appreciate it greatly um obviously you probably have heard me talking about this sort of stuff before and if not um i tend not to advertise my channel so much obviously i have close friends i have family here um who are also subscribers who see what i'm up to and hopefully enjoy the content i'm releasing and obviously, I like my channel just to spread more by word of mouth. If you come here by random chance or by someone else mentioning me, and you find and enjoy what I'm doing, then I greatly appreciate that. And I always, I always accept uh, feedback, constructive criticism. Um, obviously, if I do a good job, feel free to let me know. But then that's your choice as the consumer, as the viewer. Um, I enjoy recording these videos mostly for myself, as I always say. But I wouldn't lie to say that I'm happy enough to release these videos and hope that some people enjoy the entertainment I'm releasing, basically. Enjoy the games as I'm experiencing them or re-experiencing them, as the case can be. Uh, case in point is... This weekend, uh, over Saturday and Sunday, I'll be releasing the final 20 videos of Grandia 2 that I have recorded. I think that game was released one Monday, and I think from that Monday up until the Friday or Saturday, I basically sat down and played that game to hell. I stopped recording everything else, and only dedicated myself to recording Grandia 2, and I loved it again. I remember playing that back in 2002-2003. And I'm really glad that it got re-released on Steam, just so that it made it easier for me to release my re-experience of that game. And I hope you've all enjoyed that series, or at least some of you may have enjoyed that series. Uh, so yeah, stay tuned for that if you've any interest. Uh, in addition, you've probably noticed the massive amounts of Star Wars The Old Republic I've been releasing, both of my Bounty Hunter campaign as Valakar and of my Sith Warrior campaign as Asura. They complement each other and obviously give you an example of how the Sith Empire is running things obviously during the Great Galactic War, or the follow-up to the Second Great Galactic War at least. What you may not know is that I am releasing another series of that in the near future. I'll be playing as a smuggler, his name will be Malcolm. And that is going to be a very similar playthrough to my Bounty Hunter campaign. I'll be playing as a member of the Republic, as the smugglers do. And I'll be going through as many of the side quests as I feel I can stomach. I'll be going through, obviously, the main storyline quest. And at this point in time, I've recorded 78 videos of that series so far. I'm quite sure it's quite large. 
um, 78 videos and I think I've just recently completed chapter 1. I've made the video shorter, normally between 20 minutes and 30 minutes, similar to my Sith Warrior campaign. I've done that mostly because I understand some people may not enjoy like 40 minute videos. Um, obviously they may only have short amounts of time here to view uh, videos on YouTube. And so they just want to sit down and have 15-20 minutes of a game to enjoy. I'm different, I tend to sit down and when I want to watch some YouTube I tend to have a few hours. And so I'll just put a series on and watch it from start to whenever I need to basically take a break. But everyone has different uh, YouTube wants, wants and desires and I totally understand that. But yeah, I hope you enjoy that series when it gets released. It'll probably be coming out, I don't know, probably mid-October, depending on when I feel comfortable with its release. I'll play it by ear, but yeah, it's obviously between my Smuggler and my Bounty Hunter. One of those series I am going to be taking into the expansion content, and obviously Star Wars The Old Republic has a brand new expansion coming out mid-October. So yeah, I'm going really by how I feel about the character at the end of the main storyline, whichever one I take on and progress even further. In addition, other titles that are coming out, I've just recently picked up a game on Steam called Nobunaga's Ambition, Sphere of Influence. Now, this is a title, a series of, vid a vid a series of games that I wasn't aware of. I've never really known about Nobunaga's Ambition. Uh, by Koei Tecmo, I believe. But I am familiar with a very similar series called Romance of the Three Kingdoms. I used to play one of them, I think it was Romance of the Three Kingdoms 7. Or Romance of the Three Kingdoms 8, one of the two. But I had it on PlayStation 2. And I got into this game through a good friend, Galley Fox. And it's basically similar to like a world strategy game. I like to Shogun 2 or maybe Paradox's Crusader Kings. In that you have to manage your provinces, your castles, and basically your it's set in Japan. I think it starts in 1534, right up till the year 1700. And you have to make your clan grow powerful and try to wrestle control of Japan under your mighty or not so mighty diplomatic fist, depending on how you want to play the game. It's only... I've only looked at it briefly, I've looked through the tutorial so far, and I've looked through the character creation, uh, because you can create your own officers, your own ruler, and you can even have your own clan in the game. So there's quite a lot of potential there, and I would like to record a series of it in the near future. What I'll likely do first of all is play a campaign in my own time, so I'm fami more familiar with the game mechanics, before I record a series. So that I'm not learning all of the ropes, all the mechanics while recording. Because that might be annoying and some people will probably watch this months down in the future saying I'm a total idiot and I'm not playing the game correctly because I don't know how to play the game correctly. That's to say that in like a month's time when I go to record the content I'll know everything about the game, I'll still screw up. But that's part of the fun of experiencing and learning about games basically. In addition, I think in about two weeks, I think it's on the 22nd or 24th of September, there is a game from Frictional Games called Soma being released. Uh, if you're familiar with Frictional Games, if you're familiar with the beginnings of my channel and quite a few fellow YouTube channels, there's a game called Amnesia The Dark Descent and of course it was a horror game and I thoroughly enjoyed that. I think it was when I first started YouTube and the content wasn't great, I admit. I, I've i learned a lot in the two years I've been doing this and I think I've definitely improved um, in my editing and content releases. But yeah, no, anyway, back to Frictional Games. Soma is their next release. It is apparently a sci-fi themed horror game. Obviously horror is the main theme once again. And for all I really know is it's set below the Atlantic uh, Ocean. That's 
all I know, that's all I really... Well, I didn't even want to know that. I'm going into this game completely open-minded. I imagine there's going to be a lot of YouTube uh, playthroughs of this game. And even some of my... Even some of my YouTubers who I'm subscribed to will probably do a version of this game. And there's going to be a case of people rushing to be the first and get the, I hate to say popularity, but get the views from people who want to see the game but don't want to play it for themselves, which can be a shame. I'm not sure if I'm going to rush the game, but I'm definitely eager to play it before watching anyone else's playthrough and not have the storyline spoiled for me. Um, I did that by accident with Amnesia Dark Descent, when I say by accident. I watched the likes of obviously PewDiePie and Cryotic. Um, who else did I watch that by? Maybe Storby at the time. Hmm. But no, I watched those games and I had the storyline spoiled for myself and I didn't have the true reaction that I would like to display to you all because I like doing blind let's plays more than anything because then my reactions are genuine it's hard to fake excitement as you can probably tell <laughs> but then uh, no obviously Soma I uh, am Nobunaga's ambition Star Wars The Old Republic which I'm constantly recording right now in fact I recorded about four videos this morning I may record more this evening depending on how I feel and what else I have going on but apart from that, I'm not sure what else I have sitting in my list, in my library. I have quite a few games waiting to be recorded. Um, obviously, I still want to record more. I want to record Archimedean Dynasty, a very, very old, another underwater game. But at the moment, my recording software is not best pleased with it. Um, Fraps and both NVIDIA's Shadow Play don't like to record that game. So I'm going to have to find, and find another means to record it for you all. But uh, yeah, that's about all I really have to say uh, for this video. Obviously going into October, I'll probably have more game titles that I may want to work on that I will mention. But yeah, apart from that, feel free to comment below. I say thank you very much. Oh, since I've said thank you, that reminds me of one final thing. About, um, obviously, gaining 100 subscribers. I did this when I gained 50, but it was quite a smaller thank you. I have an entire game recorded, and I've just, early, about an hour ago, finished editing it, ready for release. And as a thank you for gaining 100 subscribers, even if I lose one or two after the fact, that's fine, obviously, people like what they like and they may not like what I'm releasing at the time. I totally understand that. But as a 100 subscriber special, I'm releasing a title called Clive Barker's Undying. It's 21 videos long. I'm going to release it throughout the entire day, basically probably split it into five videos each up until the finale, which is obviously video 21. But I'll release it all through today, all through Friday after this release, um, after this Let's Talk video, and I hope you all enjoy. I've been sitting on it for about two, three months or so. Um, I recorded that before I even started recording some of my Star Wars The Old, Re Old Republic, or some of my um, Europa, Univ Europa Universalis 4 campaigns with the Common Sense expansion. But it's a game I've sat on and enjoyed playing, and now it's ready for basically for your viewing pleasure, perhaps. <laughs> but no, this of course has been Anf Wolf with my Let's Talk video for September. I say feel free to comment if you so wish, and I will see you as we continue going on into, um, obviously, into the year, into 2015. I'll see you all for another Let's Talk video going into October. Bye-bye now.